Story time, dating edition. So once upon a time, I went on a date. We were talking and laughing and things were going great up until the moment that I made the mistake of asking her age. Apparently that's a big no-no, which is crazy to me because that's basic information. That's like if you asked where I'm from and I was like, don't worry about it. It should be a red flag, but for some reason, ladies get a pass on that one. It makes absolutely no sense. I mean, it's a date. Best case scenario, we fall in love, get married, and spend the rest of our lives together, but I can't ask you basic information like your age, your weight, or your hair color. So good luck if you ever go missing. That's going to be a real fun police report to fill out. Well, it seems we're looking for a woman of appropriate weight with pink hair that I assume is natural. Oh, and how old is she? <laughs> Don't be rude. Long story short, we've been dating for two years now, and I still have no idea how old she is. Story time, dating edition. So once upon a time, I went on a date. We sat down for dinner, and the first thing she did was try to guess my star sign. You know, one of those kind of girls. Look, I may not know my star sign, but I know a red flag when I see one. Red flag number one, she said, No, wait, don't tell me. I can feel it. Then she started waving her arms around like a voodoo princess and confidently proclaimed, You are definitely a Sagittarius. I said, No. She said, Virgo. Nope. Scorpio? Uh-uh. Mm, Virgo? You already said Virgo. Pisces. Leo? Gemini. Nope, nope, and no. She said, well, then what are you then? I said, Cancer. Ah, Cancer. I knew you were a Cancer. Oh, really? Did you? Hmm. Story time, dating edition. So a while back, I asked my girlfriend to marry me. And not to brag, but she said, no. To be fair, I did ask her on our first date, so a yes would have been a real problem. But the reason I asked her to marry me on our first date is because if you think about it, that's the absolute best time to propose to someone. There's no better version of me than me on a first date. I brought my A-game, I brushed my teeth for this. The problem is that Hollywood has brainwashed us to think that it's gotta be extra. That you've gotta take her to a five-star restaurant with violins and candlelight, rose petals everywhere because screw you flowers this is my moment but quite frankly i can't think of a worse advertisement for marriage you've never done that before and you never plan to do it again that's like if russia had a postcard with a picture of hawaii on it but i'm not about that life i want to propose in a way that truly prepares you for what it's like to be married to me like i'll wait until right after we get into a huge fight about who gave who syphilis then i'll reach into my pocket and pull out a ring like want to go have these on taxes but also, it's not even a real ring. It's a condom. I poke my finger through it, wear it like a ring, because honestly, what's the difference? Wedding ring, broken condom, either way, it's a mistake. So what do you say? Let's make it official. 